Greetings, this is a clarification video. Now, first and foremost, this will be quite obvious to anyone who is um, a reasonable and enlightened individual, but I thought to just throw it out there anyway for good measure. Now, as the title suggests, guilt by association, I just want to make my case quite clear here. There are certain individuals who I can endorse fully as individuals. So I can say these lads are legit. So I can say these mad cunts, for example, boom. I can say that they are legit. I know them and I like them. They're my good friends. So I can say that they're good men. Does that mean that we agree with each other on every single point? No, we have discussions with each other. We are reasonable adult men. We can actually have disagreements and still be friends. The important things, though, we are in agreement on. And uh, I'd say 95% on all positions are similar, but we can still disagree on things. But I can at least say that these guys are legit. However, when we're talking about other things, if we're talking about certain books, for example, and I have a few examples here that I will show in a bit. The important thing here is that if I say, if I share a video from Lauren Sudden, if I've shared a video from her two years ago, that does not mean that I endorse everything she has done since. That does not mean that I endorse everything she says or does. It simply means that I thought this video I shared of her was a good video. That's it. Same thing with articles. I can share an article from an author and I say these concepts are interesting. That does not mean that I necessarily endorse other articles said author has uh, composed. So let's take a look at a few books here. So we have Tommy Robinson, Enemy of the State. A good read, I can recommend it. Because it gives a good overview of the transgressions of the British state and it's an interesting story. Does this mean that I endorse Tommy Robinson's view on ethnicity? No, absolutely not. I think he has a faulty worldview when it comes to ethnicity. Uh, because he goes along the classic line of civic nationalism and I'm not a civic nationalism I've talked about civic nationalism several times before. So what I say is that certain elements of this book are good Certain elements of what Tommy Robinson does are good. I can endorse these things But certain other things certain other positions I cannot endorse Simple stuff really. Let's take another book The Way of Men by Jack Donovan I have recommended this book on numerous occasions and I still say the same. It's a good book. It's an interesting book with a lot of good concepts in it. Does this mean that I endorse all of Jack Donovan's positions? No. Does this mean that I am associated with Jack Donovan? No, I'm not. I'm just pointing to the fact that there are interesting concepts in this book. End of story. It doesn't mean that I endorse perhaps other positions that he has taken. And just for the record, Jack Donovan has written an article saying farewell to white nationalism, so there is already a gap there. Now, moving on to a third example. Meditations by Marcus Aurelius. There are some cool and good quotes in here. Does this mean that I endorse the book in its entirety? No, there are certain things that I don't agree with at all. And there are probably a lot of things Marcus Aurelius did in his life that I do not endorse or agree with. So I can say certain concepts that Marcus Aurelius talks about can be interesting for you to embrace in your self-improvement journey. Same thing with all of these books. Same thing with Tommy Robinson. Same thing with Jack Donovan. Do I endorse their worldview? No, I endorse my own worldview. I am associated with myself. I stand for my own reasoning. So keep that in mind. If you want to hear my take on a certain situation, come to my channel or to my Instagram and I will explain to you. So if you've heard the golden one endorsed this particular individual, it is probably not the case. It is probably the case that I've said this particular concept or this particular video or article or book was interesting. So there's a huge difference between those two. So anyway, the point being is that make the distinction between endorsing 
concepts and articles and videos and endorsing someone in their person. I have met plenty of people, I've talked to plenty of people, but that does not mean that I know them well enough to actually be able to say if they're legit or not. I can say, as I did in the beginning of this video, that these lads, my lads, they are solid and legit. I can't say that for all the other people. So, just because I talked to someone, just because I have shared a video, just because I have said that this particular thing was good, doesn't mean that I am affiliated with them. So, I hope that made sense. And yet again, if you want to know my take on a certain situation, just look through all of my videos. And certain older videos I have removed because I've updated my views. It's absolutely perfect to progress in your views. My allegiance is still the same as it has always been. Mother Sweden, Mother Europe, Mother Earth. So, thank you for watching. XOXO, boom.